Congratulations. Capricorn, happy Valentine's Day. All right, Capis, there's a lot. Ooh, you're moving forward, leaving some people behind you. You got it. You you had to get out of this horrible, horrible friendship and relationship and marriage situation. Oh, Capricorn, it's good to just move forward. All right, good news is coming in. Help is going to be coming into some sort of a situation. Trust. This situation is called for you to have faith and trust. Lies. Oh. <laughs> Truth has been told. All righty. Now, Capricorns um, who was having an affair, was it an affair? I don't think so. <laughs> all right. This is just so funny. Um, all right. So this is the seven of cups, the seven of cups. I see you're moving forward, Capricorns. You're like leaving us, um, leaving, um, people behind you and just moving forward and thinking, oh God, don't hate me because I'm beautiful. So Capricorns, I just so love this reading. I'm really looking. So we have the Gemini, whoever this uh, Aries, Leo, um, Aquarian, Gemini, Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person is, whoever this person is, I see, look at the swords at her neck. Oh my God. It's not you Capricorn. It's not you Capricorn. You Capricorn have ended some sort of a relationship with someone and they're trying to come back and shed in light. Jesus Christ, get over it. Nobody was in love with you. The sex wasn't even good. Woo, so. <laughs> oh, Lord. Anyway, Capricorns, the latest. Oh, Lord. All right, so latest, latest, latest. Listen to this. So, I don't know. Someone feels very bittered. Now they're recognizing some information about a scorpion woman. Um, oh Lord, they're recognizing some information about a scorpion woman. Um, and some of you men who are married to a scorpion woman, you're finding out some sort of information about the scorpion woman, that a scorpion woman was jealous of a, a Capricorn because they thought that this person was getting it on and, you know, having all the love they weren't having. And that is where a jealousy comes from. And this is it. People, you can't judge Capricorn because Capricorns are like this. Capricorns can look good and don't even have a part, a partner, not seeing anyone, but they're in love. They're loving themselves and they understand. I don't need a man to make me good or make me feel good. Capricorn women are just like this. They can have relationships. For years, they don't have a relationship, but yet still, the way they they show their presence out, I see that the way they, they show their presence out is that, you know, they're in love with themselves. They can have on a lingerie and they feel like the world, they are taking on the world and they're very attractive people. Capricorn women are always very, very attractive, most of them. And, you know, they have some sort of a sex appeal. And I see a scorpion is very jealous of some of you. So you got to be aware of this because a scorpion woman in the past was very, very jealous of you. And they recognize that this scorpion woman has stabbed some of you in your back when it comes down to relationship is because she thought that you were getting on with it. And you Capricorn was like, hey, I was living life. I was enjoying life. I was understanding. I was being with myself. I was learning to love myself. I was lo like coming back. I didn't have a relationship. So why were you jealous? No one wanted your husband. And why were you jealous over me that I was having all of this? No, you don't. People don't understand Capricorn. People um, need to understand, especially Capricorn. Capricorn women and men can stay without sex for a very long time. And why? The reason is that they're disciplined enough. Okay. Um, you know, if you do find a Capricorn that is a player, they will play and they will play you good. But trust me, 
Um, it will take long before you ever land this person and the, land this person in bed. And if you do land them in bed, it's because they want to see, you know, let's see the bullshit that you have. Cause I know you just have bullshit. <laughs> so listen to me, people, you know, Capricorns are one of the most complex, um, person when it comes on to relationship. Okay. Um, and a lot of people are not aware. They think that Capricorns are bitchy and especially the Capricorn women are bitchy. No, they're not bitchy. They know exactly what they want. Okay. And I see that this, um, this, this scorpion woman lied about this woman and, you know, you know, trying to, but it's because this woman has sex appeal. It doesn't really matter what this Capricorn puts on. It doesn't really matter what this Capricorn wear. This Capricorn woman have sex appeal. And I see a whole lot of you work getting hate, 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 um, from, you know, water sign women. Um, and they recognize now the lies uh, that was created, um, by a, a scorpion woman. Um, over a Capricorn woman was not true because they're recognizing, hey, this woman is someone who have respect about themselves. This woman is not someone who have been, who have been sleeping around. No. So I see that they kind of figure out or had created some sort of a story. And, um, you know, Capricorn ladies, there is a message for a Capricorn lady here. Uh, some of you Capricorn lady was, uh, either working together with a scorpion woman or um, however that is, however this person comes in your life. And, you know, you have a strong sex appeal and, you know, you're social, you're very social to people. Even when you don't like them, you can still be social um, to people. And, but your sex appeal, so, you know, men will gravitate to you and the scorpion woman thought that you and uh, uh, their family member was having an affair. Damn, damn, damn. Now, lady, back up. You know, trust me, a Capricorn don't sleep around. And if a Capricorn sleep around, she has a problem. She has been abused from a child. She has a problem. One thing with Capricorn women, they have to, you know, you have to have something. Um, so the lies you have told, trust me, this Capricorn woman would not even look at your young family member because this person was not her type. There is no way in Jose that this woman. So I see a lot of you Scorpion woman try to degrade a person and I was lying. Oh, they had an affair. She had an affair with my nephew or my niece, it's a lie. Oh, please. The, the, the person was dreaming and hoping that it will happen. Never happen. Lies, lies, lies. Hey, there is something that people do not understand with Capricorn. It's one of the hardest sign, hardest people to understand. So you Capricorn ladies are just going to be laughing. You Capricorn ladies are going to be thinking, woman, seriously, look at me. I have respect for myself. Do you ever think that I would have had some sort of an affair or relationship? Hell no. Hell no. So I see they're going to be recognizing that this lady, she tried everything and she lied. And they're going to be recognizing because this woman tried to lie that a woman had an affair with her son, with her, it's like a foreign relative. Even, you know, this relative, and I think that there was some sort of a jealous form because this child was coming to this Capricorn, you Capricorns, to talk about, uh, you know, the way that their aunt treated them, the scorpion, the aunt. I was talking to you, Alpha, you know, you have treat me with respect then. Um, and, and, and that is it. There's a form of jealousy. And the jealousy is that uh, this young person was visiting this older um woman and they would talk they basically talk because he needed or she needed to release and you know look at and was basically warning this capricorn be aware of this people because they treat me as family as shit okay this person saw the goodness in you capricorn ladies and i see you capricorn ladies help this young person 
you know, to get up and, you know, don't, you know, uh, you were helping them with their relationship uh, and that sort of a thing. So whatever the lies was, this woman created some sort of a lie that you were seeing this young person. Not true. Lies. You're jealous because uh, the young person gravitated to you Capricorn women because you Capricorn women understand where they were and you know the issues they were having in relationship the problems they were having in relationship you are someone that people can talk to and the scorpion was jealous because the person she the scorpion woman was jealous because the young person um you know recognized that she was just a bitch she was just basically the b word okay and she only cares for her family and not for the rest of the extended family. They have used this child and abused this child. Um, cheap labor, used this child as cheap labor, abused this child and looked down at this child, um, their home family member. And this child recognized that someone at least saw my potential and helped me to get a business, to get me going. And if someone is, you know, this person could go and speak to this older woman. And this woman built a whole lot of lies. This woman have a, a really mental problem. The lady built a whole lot of lies. Oh, um, and she was seeing my, 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 my niece or my nephew. Bullshit. The person was, um, protecting her from your lies and your horrible because they recognize that you and your husband was very dishonest. They were protecting this woman and telling this woman and showing this woman the light of who you and your family is, how deceptive you and your family is, and you try to build some sort of a story around this. Look at this Capricorn woman. She is a beauty, okay? Even animals are attracted to this woman because she's such a beauty. She carries such a radiation. That you don't have that. You don't have to hate on this lady. You are just late hating on this Capricorn this, this, because this Capricorn have love and light and energy and sexuality. And you don't have that. Stop hating. The young person was um, is attracted to this person in the sense that they could talk to this person. Um, you know, this person understand where there was. This person could see, um, you know, a better light. This person don't say, oh, why you did this? Blah, 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 blah. No, this, per this woman treat this other person like, um, you know, really treat this other person very good. So whatever the confusion is and whatever that was going on, it is a form of jealousy. This person did not come to use um, uh, uh, scorpions because... Uh, they recognized that this Capricorn, um, they were also, um, one of them was Capricorn, one of them was Virgo. They recognized that, that they could communicate with this Capricorn. So stop um, lying and spreading lies and the rest of it. It is a form of jealousy. Jealousy because they didn't come to you. Jealousy because you didn't have the relationship that this person have with them and it's a form of jealousy so guess what the capricorn is going to tell you whether or not whatever the little sick thought that was in your head was not there because this capricorn is a woman of stamina this capricorn doesn't sleep around and this capricorn have respect for themselves to recognize i know what my sexuality is and i know who i am but it doesn't say that I can use it to flirt around. That is not what it's all about. The woman was someone who had a conversation with someone and can, that person was able to express themselves because they couldn't express themselves to their mother or a family member and they could express themselves, um, to the Capricorn. So, you know, your little lies, secrets and jealousy. Um, you know, you know, you know, people need to recognize that people do see through the BS. Okay. Um, and people are going to be recognizing that tr people try to create drama when there's no drama. 
and uh, you know this this capricorn in this timeline of this uh, season is going to say hey people back off stop you know you know dragging my name and uh, stop you know lying about things because whatever you are conjuring up and whatever you try to get your family members to conjure it up uh, nothing is there and uh, you know have some respect for me because I've walked away and leave you people. It is about time that you walk away because maybe um you weren't having and getting any um thing from your husband. So you see this young woman. This young woman was very busy with her life. Um, this young woman would go out with other people and she have a, a, a good time and that's it. So she go home and that's it. But um. A lot of you Capricorns is going to be finding out that a Scorpion woman have been dragging your name and that you had an affair with uh, some family member of her and the rest of it. Uh, lady, go find something else to do. Um, trust me, Capricorns don't sleep around. The ones who sleep around, and this is a case that this woman that is, uh, this Capricorn woman, no, <laughs> no. Please, people, get alive. Get alive, win or lose. Win or lose. Trust the situation. Nothing happened. Um, win or lose. Some of you Capricorn, let me let go of that because that got to go, lady. Back up. Um, so, I see um, a lot of you Capricorn. Um, there was a Virgo in the past that has... Uh, a lot of feelings for you and the feeling was the same. So a lot of you Capricorn women met a Virgo in the past. Okay. This was a quick nip. Okay. Because people had invaded this relationship. It was a quick whip. And the same thing that you feel for this Virgo, this Virgo felt the same thing for you. And, um, you know, if you were wondering and, you know, you, you recognize it. It's a situation where you knew how this Virgo felt about you. You knew, um, you know, and this Virgo is saying, hell no, no, mm -mm, it's not, no. So I see a Virgo is saying, no, mm -mm, um, we don't believe the Capricorn young person because the Capricorn young person is not speaking the truth. Um, I know the person and that person because the Virgo know the person. The Virgo know this Capricorn woman. Uh, the Virgo know this Capricorn woman. The Virgo and this Capricorn woman, he knows this Capricorn woman. And he knows that the Capricorn is not speaking the truth. Because uh, uh, whatever is happening in Trans Bar, this Virgo knows mm, no, the, she is in love. We are in love with each other. We have strong emotional feelings for each other, and uh, uh, it, it's not her type. I know who is her type. No, it didn't happen. So I see a Virgo is saying, Hell no. Um, and the Virgo knows that it didn't happen. And why the Virgo knows is because the Virgo knows that uh, they and this woman have, uh, have emotional connection. Okay. Um, did they ever do it? Don't know, but the emotional connection is true. So trust the Virgo. It didn't happen. What the young Capricorn said, it didn't happen because, uh, the older Capricorn person and this Virgo have been having some sort of an emotional love triangle. It is a situation where they met. There was some sort of an interruption. But what they shared, the moment that they shared, they have not spoken. They have not dealt with it. They haven't done anything. But they know each other without an even um, someone else, you know, given whatever information they know each other, they know that each other, um, you know, the Virgo is giving up that note. Young Capricorn is lying because I know who the old Capricorn is, and why is because. 
the Virgo and the old Capricorn have a long lasting emotional um, connection. They know each other. They have been um, with each other. Someone interrupt, but the Virgo knows the heart of the Capricorn is not and was never and will never because he has been watching the Capricorn for a very long time and know that she was not seeing anyone. So, you know, people, when you're going to get your crazy little stories and crazy little situation in your mind, make sure you have something to back it because, uh, um, if you notice the sword of truth, the Virgo is trusting, trust the Virgo. The Virgo knows that the Capricorn is lying. There was no affair. There was nothing. Um, because the Virgo knows that the Capricorn have not seen anyone. And, you know, the Capricorn, the, the older Capricorn person doesn't cheat. Um, the Virgo knows that is a person that have their emotionally closed off. Okay. So if you notice, uh, um, the seven of cups is in reverse. Um, this older Capricorn woman turn off her emotions. And what you mean by turn off emotions is that uh, this woman is emotional less. And why is because uh, this woman was, uh, um, she was on a, a journey. This woman was investigating something. So she was watching she was alert she was aware she was uh, she's warm but yet still emotionally relationship wise you could not get her in bed um no this woman was on top of her game or this woman was uh, it's, uh, it's as if this woman was under some sort of an investigation and she was not going to be deterred from what she so she turned off her emotions <laughs> That is what I wanted to say. So, bam, bam, bam. And this Virgo is aware of this because this Virgo know. This Virgo has been with this person. This Virgo knows um, the person emotional is turned off, okay? Because they know that the only person that can awaken this person and turn up their emotion is they, the Virgos. The Virgos are the only one that can reach this uh, Capricorn emotion. So what this young, um, so, you know, believe and trust in the Virgo because the Virgo know that Capricorn older woman is cold. Um, you know, our emotions is turned off. So that means, uh, you know, you know, intimate wise, it's not happening. It, it, it doesn't really matter. She can go out and have a dinner with you and you think that you're getting it. It's not happening. You can, um, you know, go with her and invite her out and she will do it. But this Virgo, hey, nope, that is not giving away her goodies. That is a woman that just don't give away her goodies. It's not freebie. You know, this older Capricorn woman is not a freebie. She don't give away her goods. You have to come very, very good in order. So this Virgo is listening to the conversation. This Virgo said, nope, young Capricorn is lying. There is nothing going on. I gotta go, honeys. If you want to see the extended, follow me to the other side. This, this was so much funny. I gotta go and um, come to the other side to check out what is going on. Namaste.